These are an extraordinary pair of chairs, which were made as part of a suite for Francis Palmer, who bought a house called Kenya Park, just outside Dublin in Ireland. Sadly, the house was demolished just after the Second World War, and the suite was broken up. But we have the pleasure of owning two of these chairs right now. Now, what makes these chairs so special is, is that they are designed and made by William and Richard Gomm in about 1757. And the drawing by William and Richard Gomm is in the Winterthur Museum in America. They are extremely elaborate in the way that they are carved, and they have this very unusual open fretwork. Now, as you can see, there is open fretwork in all the areas around the frame, but the only area that there isn't is this side area, just at the, where I'm pointing. And the reason why this is not opened up is because the backs would be far too weak if this was opened. These chairs have an amazing profile, and they would have been a complete revolution when they were made in about 1757. They're inspired by Chippendale's director of 1754, and this would have been the first time that people would have seen Rococo furniture in its full glory.